I'm Justin Fort with Offroad.com. You've seen a lot of what I've done on the website, published there and elsewhere. What you don't know is that I've done a lot of off-roading, professional driving for other outlets, and I have found hundreds of hours and hundreds of gigs of video that hasn't been published in my library. So what I did when Offroad.com came to me and said, hey, would you publish some of that? I yelled, get off my lawn, hippie, and then realized it's a really good idea. So we're gonna take a lot of these videos from trails like Carnage, Imogene, Ingram, all these epic spots, and I'm gonna edit it down so it's gonna look like a five-year-old did it, and we're gonna publish it through offroad.com. Enjoy. Hey, you're fine, but you're not even at the hood yet. It's <laughs> Justin with offroad.com. You're not even half a wheel yet. Join us on a run up Silver Gulch. wettest week in Colorado ever. Commit. Torrential rains, avalanches, with legitimate 33s on there, and they were covered. <laughs> the level of the creek kept coming down, though. By the time the Jeets forerunner went across, it was barely covering 32s. It rained every day. We knew this would be a good forerunner when we found it because the front end damage that made it so inexpensive had been caused rear ending a Prius. Good sign. This FJ's on daily driver status, so it's a little, it's a little stiff and a little short for some of these longer features that uh, no problem for the longer forerunners. Yeah, the trail was a mess at this point. Previously, we'd driven right up this thing, but the rain had blown it out just that night. I think Mike was freaked out too. Some of these features were weird. Rain makes interesting trail. We wound up just dragging it with the forerunner. Go, 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 go! And throttle! There you go. Both forerunners are e locked. The Prius Killer is factory e locked. It made it an even better deal. I think he got it for $700. <laughs> the guy who bought it from him, he was literally crying when he finally pried it out of his hands. Never want to buy a <laughs> Never want to sell a truck in a Jeep because he, uh, he will make you wilt. Anyway, uh, both are e locked. His is original. Mine is uh, taken off of a 99. So my truck's 430s front and rear instead of the original 410s the three tries to get up this feature, you'll see the trail is pretty much meatloaf at this point, super squishy, and uh, even with these trail grapplers, the Nitto tires down at 12 PSI, uh, it was hard to stay on the berm, where Majid's standing right there uh, was soft, couldn't use that for purchase to straddle the water feature, you had to come hard right across the rocks we'd stacked and go up the sheer rock face like this. I had those nittos down as low as 8 PSI. The FJ pops and wheelies everywhere. This snow feature kept us from getting to the very top of Silver Basin. The bogs were full. We had tree falls. Uh, on. Dustin, what are we doing up here? Uh, cutting down some trees. <laughs> we got, we Two we different got trees. a resident had Russian be. lumberjack up here. Removed. <laughs> Two bogs, two trees, and we are blocked by an avalanche. We just came up this trail. We're going back down it to find another path to cross over to the next section. We're trying to we cross a really over tricky to tricky spot coming up here. Governor Basin. It took us probably an hour. Silver Basin. This last All the spot. crossing trails were we blown out. How to get back down. We got Sir Justin, who's making a daring attempt coming down <laughs> this rock face in order to get back down to the bottom of the trail. How do we do this? I don't know. Send Justin. These needles stuck really well. Uh, they're not wearing as well as the 
Kevlar MTRs I had on previously. They're noisier too, but uh, they're very compliant. And you'll note I literally crab walk across a wet rock face here. No slip. You also know the hand control. You always have at least one hand on the wheel. You shuffle at all times. No arm over arm. No thumbs inside the wheel. No spinning the wheel. Positive control. Dropping in on down Silver Gulch here. Jeez. Staying a little that way. 97. Okay. He's on some older... Start turning this way. Lots of brakes. E-class. That way, that way, that way. And you know they slipped right there. Uh, they were a little way. harder. It's probably a little dried out. That's why you listen to your spotter. You turned the wheel right when he was supposed to and slid right down Sorry, like I, I wanted him to. The camera. A little bit that way. You're going to straddle that rock, but you're clear. Jeep behind him is on C-class dirt tracks that are a little bit wider and new, and uh, Probably doesn't look terribly they work awesome much the better. The length in his forerunner made a lot of these options. I'm going to get du uh, Dusty coming down. Yeah, dude, you move. It's a little slippery. Both the Jeep and the FJ are on BDS leafs, but the BDS is on the FJ where it's stiff. He needs to four link that thing. I think he's planning to. If you don't Jeep stay on the, other on the hand, wall, Jeep right great. Oh, gotcha. And it takes we'll see it yeah. If you don't stay on the wall, I'm gonna hug the wall, but it's you're gonna you're gonna slide you're when you hug it. the wall. So the trick is you get on the wall and then turn it so you don't slide in that direction. You're okay. driving in that so, direction. So I'm going down. You can film, but just guide me. No, I'm giving Majid the camera. All I'm doing is guiding you. Okay. Your bravado is noted, but. Your bravado is noted, but. <laughs> Watch the Jeep twist. It works really well just the way it's set up. Whatever BDS combo he's got on here is ideal. These CJs actually weigh more than a 4Runner, and they're shorter, so some of these features were hard for him. On the plus side, he doesn't pop wheelies like the FJ, so uh, it's a lot more stable and centered. It's a neat rig. And now that he's got the carburetor adjusted properly, people don't get high riding in it. We used a uh, bearded wonder down in Silver to get the carburetor right. We didn't get any video of the FJ coming down now. This is Justin with offroad.com. Tune in for our next trail vid. We've got plenty. See you at offroad.com.